Okay, chain of command at uh, the Department of Sanitation. A lot of people don't understand it. And uh, see, here, here's Mr. Conti all the way down here. You see Mr. Conti? <laughs> That's me. And then there's these fine supervisors, Ms. Fleetwood, Ms. Concepcion, Mr. Hampton, Mr. Dumphy, Mr. Garnett. Above them, these are your lieutenants. There's Pascal at the time. She's now captain. I'll explain that in a second. Mr. Pepe, Mr. Amosquita, and Ms. Tirato. These are all your lieutenants. Okay, so these are the agents down here. And then as you go up the food chain, you have Mr. Greenwood. And Nieves, who is pretty much a silent partner in this. We didn't hear much about Mr. Nieves. And then Burke, Klingler, Garcia, de Blasio. Okay, so this is how the chain of command works in the city of New York. There's a lot, a lot of com chiefs. It's not just one. Uh, there's plenty of agents. There's not just me. <laughs> there's plenty of lieutenants, not just the ones you see. But in my chain of command, these this is how it works. So you say to yourself, well, all of these people, if all of these people wrote you up, now we know how chain of command works at DSNY. The people above them tell them, tell the people below, down below, hey, write this guy up, right? Hey, how you doing? Write this guy up, right? So now Mr. Pepe was the guy who attacked me in roll call. <laughs> He's gone. Put a big X on his name. And then there was Greenwood who was pretty much the ringleader in the class, he's gone. Nieves, he's out. And Pascal, we put up to captain. So Pascal, 2000, I'm sorry, yeah, uh, 2015 August was promoted to captain. All of my write-ups came one month later in September. What do you know? The lead antagonist, Miss Pascal, gets elevated to captain and then starts to scream down the food chain at Fleetwood, Concepcion, Hampton, Dumphy, and yes, Mr. Amasquita, who, is the, who became Pascal's number two. He went right under her bosom, and there he is out in Floyd Bennett Field training students directly under Pascal. So that's how chain of command works. And um, so again, supervisors, you know, it's it's the, your names are on all of these write-ups okay there's the 10 ticket quota there's the 206 book we know it exists if you if you keep holding to the notion that 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 all of the write-ups are real and that mr conti is a bad person he deserves to be fired it's not going to be pretty okay so now that but most importantly in any possible scenario pascal is always on top Okay, Nieves again, silent partner, hasn't said, we haven't heard much, although his signature is on a few things. Uh, I may have spoken to him once in my life, and he was apparently the Manhattan captain, he was like invisible. But in the absence of Greenwood, you put Pascal's name in there, and then Pascal now has chain of command of all of these people, Pepe Don. But Amosquita and Torado, who are running around like crazy, trying to, trying to write me up. And Fleetwood, who did, Concepcion, who got a, a write-up or two, even you, Mr. Hampton, I love you to death, but, you know, time to come clean. Time to come clean, Mr. Dumphy. Mr. Dumphy, come clean. Mr. Garnett, you know what time it is. Come clean, guys. Okay?